from Kruma Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. A weevil species has been imported into South Africa and has been released into the Crocodile River in Hartobias Port in an effort to tackle the spread of Salvinia minima, commonly known as common Salvinia. Natasha Odendahl has a story. The common Salvinia is another invasive aquatic plant native to South America that, similar to water lettuce and hyacinth, presents a substantial threat to South Africa's freshwater ecosystems. Since being initially recorded at Harabiasport Dam in 2012, Salvinia has rapidly spread across various water bodies in the northwest and Gauteng provinces and has spread to the Limpopo River, which forms the national border with Botswana. We're releasing a biocontrol agent that's never been released before in South Africa against an invasive aquatic plant called Salvinia minima. It's also known as common Salvinia. Um, it was first recorded in this area in 2012, but it's a small plant. It kind of occurred in some of the housing estates' um, properties, and we, we didn't pay a lot of attention to it. And then suddenly in um, 2020, 2021, it started to explode on Hardebeersport Dam itself. So as the as the water hyacinth declined due to biocontrol, especially um, and then over winter when there was no um, plants left on the dam, this plant took over. There was space, there was light, there's plenty of nutrients, and so it um, got to a point in 2021 where it was about close to 70% of the dam was covered by this plant. Since then, we've done surveys. We found it throughout the Crocodile River catchment. Um, it's also on the Bosport Dam, which is on the Hex River, which goes into Falkorp Dam, that then meets the Crocodile River as well. It's on uh, Bonacord Dam, north of Pretoria. It's on Rudeplat Dam. It's on Bronkospreit Dam. Um, and who knows where, where else um, it is. So it's rapidly spreading. Um, the reason why we are, well, one of the many reasons why we're concerned is it's also now in the Limpopo River and that's our border with, with obviously Botswana, um, Zimbabwe and Mozambique and so we are exporting this potentially damaging invasive species into to new countries where it's never been recorded before. The biological control agent, which was released into the Crocodile River in Harabiasburg in March, was imported from Louisiana, a state in the US that also battles Sylvania minima. Extensive research has been conducted over several years to evaluate the effectiveness of the insect as a biological agent for Sylvania. This weevil is from South America, which is where Sylvania minima comes from. The US also has this plant as a problem. They use this insect as a biocontrol agent and because it's already out there in huge numbers, um, we imported it after doing all the testing. We've done all the quarantine testing, we know it's safe, but we imported a new, um, I guess, starter kit from them this week and that's what we will be mass rearing to, to release at, at all the invaded sites around South Africa. There are plans in place to rear the weevils at rearing facilities at Rhodes University, as well as at community rearing stations around Harabias Put Dam, Valkop Dam and Bronco Sprite. That's Creamer Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insight into South Africa's real economy. And don't forget to listen to the audio version of our engineering news daily email newsletter.